Ready to get goosebumps? Researchers estimate that 99.9% .9 of all species that have ever evolved are extinct. That means our planet was once home to terrifying creatures you'd rather not meet. In today's video, we present the 15 scariest extinct animals that are guaranteed to give you sleepless nights. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Get comfy and let's dive into this exciting and creepy journey. Forest Racidae When an animal is known as a terror bird, it is obvious to conclude that we are by no means dealing with a harmless peacock. Not only that some representatives of this family could grow up to 3 meters, no, they could also kick incomparably strong. For the number of friends among you, a 70 kilogram heavy terror bird could produce a reaction force of 2400 newton with a kick. Or in other words, one kick was enough to break countless bones in a gazelle or an ibex. However, the apex predators which became extinct around 18,000 years ago had another trick up their sleeve. They could quickly turn their large beaks into endogenous axes and hack powerfully at their victims. In addition, it was easy for the flightless animals to run through the landscape at 50 kilometers per hour. Although some of the more than 20 species may have even scraped the 100 kilometer mark. Titanoboa If you're already scared and anxious at the sight of modern giant snakes, you'll have to be extra strong now. With lengths of up to 9 meters, anacondas and reticulated pythons are considered the largest snakes in the world. The Colossus, which has the scientific name Titanoboa, and up until 58 million years ago snaked across our globe but even brought it to a length of 13 meters. With a weight of clearly more than 1.1 tons, the snake finally advances to the largest known snake species of the Earth history. Smilodon Although often referred to as saber-toothed tigers, the three species of Smilodon were not, strictly speaking, more closely related to the striped felines. While the massive canines protruded up to 20 centimeters from the carnivore's mouth, its compact body brought it to a total weight of more than 300 kilograms. Extinct around 12,000 years ago, fossil finds show that the Smilodon sometimes engaged in fierce battles with its prey. In view of the shattered spines and broken leg bones, many experts assume that the saber-toothed cat did not shy away from adult mammoths. For this purpose, it could have climbed onto the back of its victim and rammed its imposing canines into the body. Other researchers, however, consider it more likely that relatively smaller animals were on the menu, such as giant sloths. Gigantopithecus The exciting legends about Bigfoot are true. Well, you could get this idea anyway if you took a look at the reconstructions of Gigantopithecus. As a giant among the apes, this primate could have brought it on an unbelievable body size of 3 meters. At the same time, particularly heavy specimens could weigh in at half a ton. According to the current rate of research, Gigantopithecus was a close relative of the orangutan, which disappeared from the early scene about 100,000 years ago. Consequently, our direct ancestors might have run into this King Kong in the flesh. The fact that humans had its fingers in the play of the extinction of the Gigantopithecus is considered, however, improbable. Probably the giant apes died out because the forest areas changed in the course of time to savannas so that the scarce food supply made them the guard. Pentacopterus Pentacopterus decorahensis, or the giant scorpion from prehistoric times. With a length of up to 1.7 meters, the species discovered in 2015 may have spread fear and terror in the seas during its lifetime. While the giant became extinct around 460 million years ago, experts assumed that it displayed a predatory lifestyle. For example, the forward-leaning orientation of the second and third pairs of legs indicates that the limbs were used to catch prey. Fundamentally, researchers describe the fossil find recorded in an ancient meteorite crater in Iowa as both bizarre and breathtaking. For example, the condition of the discovery allowed them to analyze even the finest details, such as scales, spines, and bristles. Helicoprion Take a predatory fish from prehistoric times, place a small circular saw in its mouth, and the helicoprion is ready. What is so casually said, of course, alludes to the unique body feature that this extinct cartilaginous fish called its own. 
In detail, the spirally rolled up tooth row counted up to 180 individuals' bite ears. But that's not all. Studies indicate that the helicoprion could also rotate its body saw back and forth to cut up its prey. How large this swimming predator became about 270 million years ago, however, is disputed. The relevant estimates range from 5 to more than 10 meters. Hallucigenia If you didn't know that Hallucigenia lived on our planet until 505 million years ago, you might think you were dealing with a creature from a classic science fiction flick. And indeed, the peculiar name is no accident, given the countless tentacle-like outgrowths that covered the body of this marine creature. British paleontologist Simon Conway Morris said that this creature looked like it came from an intoxicating hallucination. Fabromis Patersoni In our modern days, capybaras embody the largest rodents in the world. Thus, the animals can reach a height of up to 1 meter and weigh over 75 kilograms. However, these are values about which the Fabromis Patersoni could only smile wearily. So the monster rodent from prehistoric times became well and gladly 700 kilograms heavy and reminded with his stature of rather a full-grown buffalo. It is estimated that the relatives of the guinea pigs reached body lengths of 3 meters, completed by a 1.5 meter long tail. Meganura Who does not know it? There, one wants to go to sleep in a warm summer night, but as soon as the light is switched off, it begins to hum, agonizingly shrill at our ear. But now imagine that an uninvited guest is not as big as a tiny mosquito, but has a wingspan no less than 70 centimeters. If this idea resembles a horror scenario for you, you can be glad you missed the era of the Meganura by 300 million years. In detail, the fluttering giants, which visually strongly resembled dragonflies, were among the largest insects to ever buzz through the terrestrial skies. Purosaurus with a length of 6.17 meters, the Philippine inguinal crocodile Lolong was the largest representative of its species ever measured. Now, however, one must keep in mind the Lolong became just half as large as the mighty Purosaurus. So the experts assumed that this genus of crocodiles could become even 12.5 meters long. Extinct about 8 million years ago, the skull of the carnivore alone measured 1.4 meters. Purosaurus probably spent the majority of its life in the water, where it consumed turtles, fish, drinking mammals, and even other crocodiles. Megarachne In the case of the Megarachne, scientific options differ. Originally classified as the largest spider to ever crawl across the Earth, more recent findings suggest that we are more likely dealing with a representative of the sea or giant scorpions. However, it is undisputed that the Megarachna, with a leg span of up to 70 centimeters, presented an equally strange and disturbing picture. The fact that the animal which lived about 100 million years before the age of the dinos reached such astonishing dimensions was due to the high oxygen content in the extensive primeval forests of the Carboniferous. Camaroceros Since no fossilized soft parts or stomach contents of Camaroceros have been found so far, very little is known about the exact way of life of these cephalopods. It is certain, however, that the bizarre-looking water dwellers grew pretty big. According to this, the shell of this species reached a length of up to 9 meters. Compared to this, however, the soft body inside was significantly smaller. Due to the sheer mass that the Camaroceros had to carry around, it was probably not capable of dynamic swimming maneuvers, but moved around very leisurely. Perlagernus sandersi Big, bigger, Perlagernus sandersi with an estimated wingspan of 7.38 meters, this Oligocene creature can claim to be the largest known flying bird in history. For classification, the modern record holder, the wandering albatross, brings it to a maximum wingspan of 3.7 meters. Before Perlagernus sandersi, which lived about 25 million years ago, was discovered, Argentavis magnificens was considered the largest flying bird of all time. Arctotherium angustidens Along with Kodiak bears and Kamchatka bears, polar bears are considered the largest land-dwelling predators. Particularly large male polar bears can weigh up to a ton, but this does not even bring them close to the weight of Arctotherium angustidens. 
So this bear, which was native to South America about 1.2 million to 11,000 years ago, probably weighed between 1.75 and 2 tons. Basically, it might have been a little picky omnivore, but the discovery of numerous broken molars indicates that the giant bear preferred to devour meat and bones. Despite their massive size, the furry predators may have been outcompeted over time by other predators such as the Smilodon and switched to a more plant-based diet. Megalodon Imagine swimming happily in the ocean, and then you see this, a 20-meter-long colossus flashing its nearly 20-centimeter-long teeth. Fortunately, nowadays, we no longer need to fear such a scenario. The mighty Megalodon has been considered extinct for 2.6 million years. Equipped with extreme biting power that was 10 times stronger than that of the great white shark, Megalodon may have mainly hunted adult whales, but it probably didn't say no to manatees, turtles, seals, and fish either. So folks, now it's your turn. Which of the featured animals captivated you the most? Dig deep into your keyboard and tell us below in the comments. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up and a subscription to never miss one of our videos again. And with that, thanks for watching, take care and see you next time.